Okay, this is the gyro sensor which I have placed uh, at the middle of my uh, chassis. And uh, this gyro sensor is connected to Arduino. And power supply I have given from uh, motor driver board. And this is the data cable which I have connected to my laptop. Now, uh, before you st uh, start uh, running the calibration file in your Arduino uh, board, uh, try make your robot to stand still uh, uh, with its center of gravity. So here I'm struggling hard to make it to stand uh, on its center of gravity, but still somehow I managed to. But yeah, now it is standing. Now the calibration uh, uh, script, this this calibration file, uh, I have put it in the description. Download that calibration file and try to run it uh, in your Arduino. So compile the file. Basically, you won't get any error uh, if you download that file from the link which I have given you. And once uh, the compilation is done without any error, upload the script to Arduino board. Now, uploading is done. Now, go to serial monitor, open your serial monitor. Once you open the serial monitor, it asks us to type a character. So I have typed R and I have pressed enter. Once you press enter, uh, calibration process starts. Uh, if the connection is successful, you get MPU6050 connection successful. If anything is wrong in the wiring, it will uh, give you as uh, the uh, connection is failed. Uh, you just don't uh, shake your uh, uh, robot. If you shake, uh, I don't think so. It takes much time to calibrate. Just keep uh, in a steady state. Once you keep it in a steady state, uh, you get to see the offset value as well as uh, your gyro value. Now what you need to do is you need to copy the second line. Uh, in the sense, uh, the offset, your offset line is there. No? That has to be copied and it has to be pasted in the IMPU60 latest code file which I have uh, put in the description. Uh, here you have to go to this part of the code where you get to see MPU offset of 6. Uh, so these 6 values has to be replaced with uh, your offset line is there, no? the second line here. This has to be pasted in the other script. So I'll just copy this to a notepad. Once you copied those uh, offset values to the latest code, uh, compile this code. And if the compilation is done successfully without any error, upload this code to Arduino. And open the serial monitor. And in your serial monitor, both yaw, pitch and roll you should get 0, 0, 0 so not exactly 0, 0 but at least approximately you have to get 0, 0, 0 in my case I am almost getting both yaw, pitch and roll as 0, 0, 0 if this is happening so your calibration of MPU6050 is successful thank you